In this lesson, we're going to look at a few more new features added to the Notes app in iOS 11. I'm going to use the iPad for these examples. But remember, the interface on the iPad is pretty much the same as the iPhone. Except on the iPad, you always see the Notes list here on the left. We've previously had the ability to sketch drawings and notes, but when doing so, you'd be brought to a dedicated sketching screen. Now in iOS 11, you can sketch without leaving your note. If you prefer going to the full sketch page, tap the plus button here and then add sketch. To do an inline drawing, just tap the marker button here. We get the full array of sketch tools and color options below. When I start sketching, notice that a yellow separator line is added between the sketch and the text above. To continue drawing further down the page, just scroll up with two fingers. When you're finished, tap the X and we can go on adding text or other items below that sketch. Tap on the sketch to copy, delete, or share it. Sketches can be saved to your photo library, printed, or saved as an image file into the Files app. The next new feature is Tables. Tap here above the keyboard to add a table. Use these triple dot buttons to add or remove columns and rows. Then just tap inside a cell to enter some text. Tapping Next will move you from left to right in the table, so entering your data can be done pretty quickly. It's also possible to format the text in specific cells to bold, underlined, or italic. With any cell selected, tap the Table button again to copy, share, convert to text, or delete the table. The next new feature is Pin Notes. This lets you keep certain notes at the top of your notes list all the time. I like to do this with my grocery list since it gets used about once a week. To pin a note, simply swipe right on it. That adds the note to a pinned notes section here at the top of the list. If I create another new note, it's going to be placed under my pin notes. To unpin a note, just swipe right on it again. Swipe left on a note and we can delete it, move it, or now lock it right here. Previously, you had to lock a note from the share sheet. This makes it much more convenient to quickly lock a note with your password. To learn more about how to use notes, check out the mini tutorials collection available on themacu.com. 